Hello everyone and welcome back to Will You Press The Button? Now, in the last episode I said I would go off with space chicks rather than roll the solar system. So, God knows what I'm going to say this episode, so let's quit delaying and jump right into it. You become internet famous, but you can never make money from it. See, that's interesting because you can become internet famous and get a real job from it as a, I don't know, as a talk show host, stuntman, whatever it is you want to do, but... Mm. Actually, yeah, I would, because if you become internet famous, it's bound to grab the attention of someone. Yes. Yes. Okay, next one. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, you have the ability to turn invisible, but only while no one is looking. Okay, whoever made this question is a big fan of Mystery Men. If you haven't seen Mystery Men, it is... a quite underrated Ben Stiller film but the one of the characters in there could only turn invisible while no one was looking and it went through the whole film and spoilers ahead he actually did turn invisible while no one was looking and it was the most bullcrap power ever. no no give me devil horns or something at least it will look dope Next one. Everyone on the internet has impeccable grammar, spelling, etc. But you're the sole exception. Mm. Nah, I'll be the butt of too many jokes and I've already got too many jokes pointing up. Yes, yes, people agree with me. You have complete control over your brain. But the roof of your mouth always itches. You see, that is another golden question. Because if you've got complete control over your brain, your brain is connected to your full nervous system, as everyone knows, apart from, well, toddlers and droolers. But if you've got complete control over your brain, that means you'll be able to kill the receptors that are telling your brain that the roof of your mouth itches. So that's a win-win. You would literally become the most highly functioning person on the planet and you could just kill that emotion. You... Oh, no, press the wrong thing. Oh, well, at least people agree with me. I would have pressed it, but, oh, damn. You write one of the most beloved novels in history, but it's written under a pen name and no one will ever know it was you. Fun fact, apart from the most beloved bit, I actually have written a book. Actually, I've written two by the time that this video is recorded. And it is under a pen name. Well, not really a pen name. It is my name, but it's just a pen. So I actually have written a book and not many people know about it because I don't go around like if people want to read it, that's fine. So... Yeah, I've already done that. I've already pressed that metaphorical... Yes. Yes. People agree with me with my metaphorical button. My author bros out there. Hey, if you're an author, leave a comment down below and say you're an author and what you've written. Because I would actually like to see and get in touch. Because, you know, authors are really interesting people. That's not a pun, by the way. That's just fact. Uh, um... You can read that bit, but I'm not going to say it. No. See, see, love, love prevails. Love prevails over anything. Well, maybe except a heart attack, but apart from that. Next one. You become the best inventor, scientist and engineer in the world, inventing a lot of things that make life easier and various uses but you'll be seen as a villain and as you use violence to bring peace under your way to think so really you're a star wars darth vader mixed with tony stark 
Yeah, I'll do that because I'll take it out on all the morons first. Yes, yes, there's a lot of sick-minded individuals just like myself. They release all Pokemon games in one, but the soundtrack is all Nickelback and it always has to play when you play it. Well, first off, the first half is just stupid because if they release all games in one, then that means they'll never upgrade to new systems with new features. And plus this right here, Nickelback. That just makes me want to say no instantly. 49% of people like who, who where are these 49% of people they need to they need to be corrected Nickelback is terrible Don't fall for the Pokemon games cuz you got you can't have all games at once because by the time you have completed another one they won't be able to make ch oh! People are stupid Okay next one you get the perfect girl. She looks, feels, and is amazing in every way. But this only applies to you. To everyone else, she looks, feels, and smells horrible. That don't bother me in the slightest. Yes, yes, people don't. See, it's what's inside that counts, kids. You can save your dying child but you can never see or hear from them again. That is... Well, to go from that to that, ooh, that is a... That is a hard one. But I would have to say, yeah, because at least I'd know that I love them enough to do that. See, see, people are selfless. People are selfless. The next one. You get the body shape you desire, but you have to work out to keep it. That's just life. That's not even a tempting offer. I can walk to the back of my house and there is a gym about half a mile away from me. Do I visit it? No, because I like cake. It's better. But this is just life. You get the body shape you want, but you have to work out to keep it. That's just life. I could go and do a thousand sit-ups and look like a scrawny testicle. But I'm not going to because I like cake. So no. 70. This is just life, you morons. This is just life. If you want the body shape you desire, go to the goddamn gym. Oh, morons. Uh, next one, YouTube goes back to its original layout, but your favourite YouTube channel is shut down. No, I won't. I, I'm, I'm not going to do that. Yes, yes, 69% of people said no. Let's go to the next one. You have unlimited gasoline but you can only drive that one car for the rest of your life. Okay, this right here is an example of a win-win. You get unlimited gas at oh, home, but mind you, it doesn't say that it's free. Oh, you see, anyone can have unlimited anything if they're willing to pay for it, including some naughty things in the shadows of the night. Oh, no, I can't do that because it doesn't say it's free. No, people, you're not reading the question. It doesn't say that it's free. Oh. Next question. You have the best collection of books in existence, but you can't talk. Nope. The books I like are not really liked by society anyway. Next, you never have to do chores again, but they're always done by your mother who judges your life choices while she does it. 
but if you make good life choices, then she's got nothing to judge you on. So, bonus, yeah. I'm going to press that button. I'm going to finger that button hard. People obviously making bad life choices. You will win a million dollars. You will, sorry, you will win millions of dollars, but you will die a virgin. Um... Well, moving on, <laughs> all of your pockets now lead to a different dimension. If you root around in it for about seven seconds, you can pull out whatever you want, provided it will fit in the width of the pocket. But there is a carnivorous and indestructible interdimensional creature. Sorry, try saying that when you're sober. Living in the pocket universe. <laughs> the pocket universe. Oh, oh, please tell me the person who wrote this likes Rick and Morty because this is, this is gold right here. The pocket universe which desperately wants to eat you. <laughs> And get close enough to bite you in 6.5 seconds. <laughs> so, really, if I wanted to, I could just chuck anything into a pocket. But mind you, what class is, classifies big as a pocket? Because if I get a mile wide sheet of denim and just fold it in half, technically that's a pocket. No. No, because no one my look, the carnivorous creature will go for my lovely manhood first. No! Oh! I pressed the wrong thing again! Oops. Metal Gage pressed the wrong button. Great. Next, you can control the sun and the moon at will without moving time. But you lose your sanity a little more every time. The only reason I would want to control the moon is to find a werewolf and to shrink the moon and just shrink it really tiny so that it disappears from sight so that as they're howling in the sun they suddenly return to human naked so no I'm not going to do that there is no re Voice it. What are you going to get out of controlling the sun apart from a sunburn and cancer, you nitwit? Your entire life has a musical underscore that you alone can hear. But you have a good idea of what's going to happen at any given moment because of the style and intensity. This is dope because that just means you can avoid anything bad happening to you and you get a dope soundtrack in your head which if you really wanted to you could just memorize it, write it down and become a famous orchestra. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to press that button. Yes, yes, people like having music to their own lives. Now... I'm going to leave this question to everyone else. I'm sure I'm going to have my own views, but I want to hear your views. The Earth resets and you become God to design it as your own. But you die after making the world. Now that's an interesting question. But anyway, I have been your host, Metal Gauge. If you like this video, go on ahead and hit that like button. If you loved this content, Go and hit that subscribe button as it would really be appreciated. Go ahead and leave a comment down below. I do read and reply to as many as I can. And until the next episode of whatever it shall be, I will see you in the next episode. Good night.